Hello there, I'm Alger Hill, and welcome back to some European Universe 4. Cradle of Civilization is playing the Mamluks, or the Mimluks, whatever you prefer. It's 13th of October, 1490, and I'm about a half a foot higher right now than I was last, last recording. So I'm going to sound a little bit weird, but I'm sure we'll make it work. So, uh, I'm going to need to invade the Karamanese, and I'm also fighting Kaffa for control of that gold province. And I'm going to need to invade the Karaman pretty soon, to be honest. Like, honestly, kind of now. But like, manpower is just terrible. It's just, it's just awful. So I'm pretty frightened about that. Because like, at the moment I cannot deal with the Ottomans. I'm still crushing rebels left and right. I'm going to wait for these guys to fall. And then I'm going to move to the north. And I think I'm going to turn the volume down just a touch. Because it's just a little loud. For some reason it turns off as soon as I yell tab. Basically my computer turned off. Which was super great. It was just the best thing ever. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Full screen window. There we are. I had to restart. That's all right. Uh, my computer just basically crashed, and I had to basically reinstall Windows, which was just great. That's why there's a little hiatus for these episodes. Good God, the Renaissance is taking a long time to spread to me, but it's spreading slowly but surely. I kind of think I should be uh, trying to force it to spawn in, like, Cairo or something. I'm trying to instill those diplomat points, but... Uh... Obviously, the next tech is going to definitely need to be an administrative idea. But I really do want to get this idea group so I can start... Well, it's not an trips, a military idea. Probably going to end up being quality, but to be honest, quantity would be really nice too, because of that manpower. However, you do get 33% manpower from aristocratic ideas, which is very, very useful. Um, where's the other manpower? It's not offensive. Defensive gives you some maintenance reduction, which I do like, and I like the attrition. Also, the thing is, with defensive, it's kind of the same thing as, as manpower, because you don't lose as many troops due to attrition. Uh, obviously, quality doesn't really give you any of that sweet, sweet manpower, but it just gives you a lot of more useful soldiers, whereas quantity does give you that 50% manpower. But the thing with quantity is it's very, very good if you're a small nation, because of that huge, huge force limit modifier. I just want that first idea group, honestly. A 50% base manpower. Oh, so good. So maybe I should consider aristocratic, because the autonomy change and absolutism is really sexy, as the mil tech costs. Um, the army tradition is okay. The diplomat and leader of our upkeep is very nice. And the mercs I'm trying to stay away from. But the leader siege, oh, that's the shit right there. Mm, I'll think about that when I, when I get to it. I really do want the manpower, though. There's a thing. Aristocratic's kind of that, that kind of mixed group. It allows you to get a lot of things. Uh, uh, Nas, having been educated to the little warriors since early age, Memlik slaves often have the complete trust of their owner and employer. Their sons, the Alwad Nas, having grown up from, for under far more convenient and living, forgiving circumstances, God, I'm terrible at reading today, are generally considered far less able and loyal. Unable to serve as royal Mamluks, the Alawad al Nas instead constitute a social elite within regular military units and in the lower administration. These noble sons themselves are, however, continually trying to prove that they are ready for bigger responsibilities. With the, posi the open position of command for the defenses of the Transjordan state, a number of them are hoping that we will entrust them to this task. Appoint one of the sons, and al Karak gets manpower modifier ooh, for 10 years and local defensiveness by lose legitimacy, or gain legitimacy, and it gets unrest because it's a Mamluk commander. Okay, where is this Al. What is it? al -Karak. Right. So it's the Transjordan state. Well, that, that's not very helpful, is it? I like how it doesn't really... It only shows me three places, so it doesn't exactly matter. Um, so let's, let's just lose a little bit of the legitimacy and get that manpower. And we are just crushing these guys very easily. Ah, oh, they're gonna get sieges, aren't they? Damn it. I guess they're chasing them down again. Oh my god, really? Rebels again? You are just being ridiculous now. You just gotta go away, okay? Hey, there we go. Marsh, so. They're going to get a benefit, but it's all right. Give them this Ah, oh, what? They're going to get away. Freaking... Guys, guys, so annoying. There you go. Just wipe these guys out real quick. And then we just immediately wipe them out as well. But surprisingly, they're... they're I'm, I'm a tech ahead of them, but I don't really have any artillery. This is the problem.
Right, you. Time to bugger off. Come here. Come here. Come on. There you go. That's what I thought. Finally. Du -du 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 -du. Just wipe them out real quick. And then move over there. And we're going to have to do something to those rebels over there, because that's a serious problem. God, our manpower is just so bad. Can barely handle this, honestly. It's a bit overwhelming. Hisfeyan uh, in Hisinkapa. Let's figure out what that is. Oh, this place. Seriously, why are you so pissed off? Extension. Non-accepted culture. Just, just, just go away. I cannot deal with you right now. Then in six years, fine. The coring of the the these states is a problem. Alright, there we go. Seen Jakatif, thank you. Alright, we'll send half of you guys that way. Half of you guys that way. Off we go. Turn the maintenance down. Lack of demand for frankincense. Oh no, my frankincense value. Luckily, we're still stupid rich, so that's alright. We need to control more trade power in this area as well if we want to try and get more income. We also want to try and control. We're going to be able to get this trade power from Kappa, so that's okay. My Kappa, Counterman. Oh, these guys are going to do something as soon as the war starts. I know they are. We're going to have to just get our manpower ready. Why is it going to wreck us? All right, come on. We got our sniper zissy general here. It's gonna be on Highlands, yes, but that's okay. Wait, what? Ah, I still don't have a claim. Damn it! What am I doing? Still don't have a goddamn claim. We do have claims in Ethiopia, though, so that's okay. Keep trying to glab them. Glab them? Grab them. Uh, it's going to take like two and a half years to get the manpower just to, just to deal with our deficits right now. Insane. God, the Renaissance is killing me over here. I basically desperately need to just shove as much as possible to try and spawn the Renaissance because this is getting a bit crazy now. God damn, arid, causing me even more attrition. All right, there we go. We'll increase our maintenance all the way. Wait for our diplomat to tick over. Thank you. Oh, shit. Uh, do we don't. It doesn't really matter which one I claim. Just get the good province one. All right, let's get the capital then. Thanks. Oh my god, they did not just ally the Golden Horde. Oh, it's okay, they're basically no one. That's fine. Son of a bitch. Oh, gotta wait the month tick. Yes, yes, yes. Alright, come on then. Hello. The hell they escaped like crazy. How the hell did they get away so fast? Just escaped. Islands, but I don't really care. I mean that fire bonus. Alright, Kaffa. So obviously I want these provinces. Um, because they're really nice. These ones could be good too, but to be honest, they're not really Oh, there is gold in Kaffa. That's two gold provinces I would be able to get. I think I should probably take them. Yeah. I don't want to take too much because then it kind of kills me, but I want I want those gold provinces. Thank you very much. I'll take your war reps too. Because it doesn't really matter. And I'll also end rivalry. Just for that extra prestige, though it doesn't really matter. 
All right, let's take it. Nah, it doesn't really matter. I got the prestige anyway. Oh my god, yes. That's amazing. God, look at that. That really hurts my overextension. But... Look at this. Two gold provinces. That is what dreams are made of, guys. And there's 4,000 men in the Great Horde. I think we're going to be okay. Oh, and the Great... The, oh, shit. Okay, this might be the time. The Ottomans is, war, is at war again. They're fighting Albania, Hungary, and Venice. So let's take a look at this. So... The Ottomans have a bit more, bit less men than me. Okay, so that's good. They are fighting Hungary. How many troops does Hungary have? Oh no, Venice has a lot. I think they might have just been stack wiped. <sighs> Hungary, where are you? No, Hungary. You were supposed to be the chosen one. Should be giving them subsidies or something. But where'd it go? Okay, they got some, but they're not gonna be able to stand up. I'm not going to stand up to the Ottomans, but this could be a time to try and fight them. Maybe. All right, fine. Half maidens. Fine. Be like that. We should also be spending all our cash on building more buildings. For example, more manpower modifiers. Considering that's our biggest weakness. 16 dollars. Ooh, 29 28 There we go. Oh shit! What am I doing? Why am I going to half millions? I need to go maximum. Jesus, these guys almost killed me. They might, they might have been able to murder me. That would have been terrible. That would have been terrible. There we go. Right, there we go. We can get some of our set sweet, sweet looting. And we'll assign them to Sniper. Let's go kill the rebels. Oh, yes. Give me that gold. Give it to me. Oh, they're actually attacking me. Thanks. I suppose I should start getting claims on Adal as well. Man, they have a lot of allies. Holy shit, they have a lot of allies. Yemen's yeah, allied with Dal and Musangoli. These guys are allied with Hormuz and Merihan. Jesus, these guys are... They have a lot of alliance chains. Alright, you go up to the capital. Alright, there we go. Put that to half maintenance. The Ottomans are definitely in a st are stuck in. Oh, look, they've already got their war goal as well. Hungary's not doing anything. Come on, Hungary. Get it together. Benign neglect, trade power, tax, manpower, please. Problem is, also, they have, like, complete naval control over the entire area. So they would just wreck our face if we even attempted to do anything, navally speaking. Alrighty. The plague in Cairo. Oh my god. The plague was a continuous process. It killed 12,000 people in a single day. Proof that Allah is not with the Sultan. Local unrest minus three. Oh, that's, that's good. But makes me poor as shit. As well as my manpower. Damn it. It's unpleasant. Also quite a lot of states. Eruz Eruzum is a definitely a good place to state. I think. Oh, damn it. It was there. Where are you? I had you. Where'd you go? Fuck it. Let's just search for it. How do you spell it? Erzuum. Fine. Oh, hello, Grey Horde. Wait, what? Oh, that's Karma's forces. I was really confused. Alright, we'll state these guys too. Hello. Hello. How are you doing, girl? 
you take back uh, Sniper Vissi. And you take Sheik Alamadi, so we can try and get some training done over here. At least we're replenishing our manpower, finally. I don't think you've made the right choice, buddy. I think you made a whoopsie. Alright, you train, you do the drilling. And we're gonna try and kill these suckers. There we go. Even though it's a minus three, we still kick ass. There's not really a lot they can do. Oh, the Ottomans have totally won that war. Hungary, please. Sort your life out. Ooh, yeah. Although they have less manpower now, they have built up to their force and they have a lot of artillery. Oh my god, what? Where did they even come? Jesus. I hate you so much. We're the worst. Goddamn rebels, I swear to god. Come on, tick over. Obsessive perfectionist, of course he is. Why would he be something useful? Please tick over. Please tick over. Thank you. Oh my god. And they won't let me vassalize them because the goddamn great horde is sticking around being a douchebag. Go away. I have destroyed you. You are nothing. Let's wait for them to move on. Hello, 16th of October, 20th of October. Nice. See you later. Bye. Three war score. Come on. You can't beat that. Hey, look at that. That let me that let me vassalize. Coolie, so we're gonna get make make them my vassals and take all their cash. So can I become a vassal and they will pay me ducats. God, it'll cost me a lot of power. That's okay. Beautiful. Okay. Let's head down south. Yes, I know you don't like me very much, but that's how it is gonna be. So we need, before we can fight the Ottomans though, we have to be fighting Kara, um, so that we can call them in. This is the problem. Oh my god, the Serenity Separatist, please. Leave me alone! I have to have all these forts as well, which is kind of important, kind of necessary. Gotta build back up our tradition, because we wasted a lot of it for manpower. Surf is growing in popularity. Strengthen me towards mysticism. Legalism, I guess. Sure. God, I wish I could go towards mysticism. I really wish I could stick. I'll, I'll go towards mysticism, but I'm not really going to get any benefit from it, which is annoying. Okay, I desperately need to enforce Renaissance because this is getting a bit ridiculous now. I cannot afford technology. I literally cannot afford it. Just try and spread it a bit faster. How many more? Ah. I really, really do want to spread it faster, but I can't really afford it. There we go. Fantastic. I spread it nicely. What is... I should have gone merchant guilds. It doesn't matter. Okay, so... We can embrace it very shortly. In a couple of years' time. Still gonna take me a few years now to get the Admin Tech 7. Is there any points I can get? So I could get some points from you guys, but I kinda need your loyalty. From the merchants, we could get Diplo support from these guys. Can't get Admin support until 1495, so next year.
Let's go, boys. Yeah, it's, you guys suck. Okay. Onwards, Christian soldiers. Actually, we're Muslim soldiers, so not quite the same, but... Let's get them. 13th of June, 19th of June. Right, we should wait then. 19th, nice. Where's the next bloody rebels? Sorani in five years. 1.6 years for Dalmatian separatists. Come on. Why are you so pissed off all the time? What's the big idea? Go away. Go away. There we go. And the Olima wants some buddies. All right. So this should definitely be a thing. Ah, uh, we can only have 16 states and we can't have it. Damn it. That'd be an even better province. There we go. Oh, the thousands of men that are dying, please. Alrighty. Reduce that maintenance. Get rid of that war exhaustion and overextension, and I think we should finally try and have a bit of a period of peace. I know. Crazy idea. Oh my god, these guys are so pissed. These guys are just pissing me off now. We do need to chill for a little while. The Ottomans have already won their war, so there's no point fighting them for a long time. As long the thing is, though, we've curtailed the Ottomans' eastward expansion. Jesus Christ, look how much they're sieging. So, the further west they push, the more aggressive enemies they're going to find. Really wish I could get Austria on my side. That would be spicy. But we'll have to figure this out in the next episode. Um, we're going to need to move our troops very carefully. And I think we should try and fight Hormaz again. Because of those sweet, sweet gems. Adal, give me your claims. Thank you. Kara, get some claims from you later on, baby. And we just got to keep fighting. We can't go west anymore, and we can't go north. Uh, we can go east, we can go southeast, and we can go south. But we need to have at least, I don't know, five years of peace, because we are just dying right now. Like, we are fully 100% close to death. It's not great. You, you need to have this guy, and you should be drilling as well. That way we can at least ensure that we're gaining back our army professionalism. So make sure you check out all the other series I have on my channel. Do also leave a like and a comment on the video. Let me know what you think of the series so far. I was Aldrin Luckin' Teen to be, and this has been some EE4 Mavericks. Bye-bye.